Hi friends, this is Chris with Josephine's Design. I am back with the same kit, plus a little bit extra. I am in my planner that is from she's in her apron.com. I love this planner. We have somebody who I've told by messaging they have won the drawing, but I haven't heard from them. So if you are there, Kathleen Beers, please email me at josephinesdesigns.com at gmail.com and I will mail it to you. All right, friends. So I hope um, you will see that you don't have to have everything. You can just have a little and you can work it out and it'll all be good. So that's what I'm wanting to show you here, guys, that we are going to keep it simple. It is going to be great and it's going to be fun. Okay, so the first thing I'm going to do is put that pretty girl right there since today is Monday and it is Valentine's Day. She will be there. Also, always keep these if you journal. They are fantastic to use if you journal. Okay, so now I'm going to come back. One, two, three, four. So that's perfect. I'll have all of these for the week. All right. Now, so how is your day going? I'm hoping that it is going beautifully well. Um, ours is really busy. Um, <laughs> really busy. Um, but I'm so thankful for that because sometimes we just need to be busy and be thankful for that, right? All right. And I mean, we are taking care of grandbabies. I just hung up with the grandbabies and my oldest daughter and, um, our poor oldest granddaughter has the sniffles and, um, it looks like it may be allergy, but you know, trying to keep an eye on her and she was hilarious. I could hear when her mommy answered the phone. She always answers on speaker. And she's like, Mimi Chris. I could hear her from the back. So she is so cute and so sweet. And anyways, and then our daughter also sent us a picture of her teaching her little sister, her, her two-month-old, almost three-month-old little sister, um, shapes and colors. It was fantastic. And so I love that. And I, I really try every time there, I'm always trying to tell her, you know, be a really good big sister and love your sister and you know, all the things that we tell our children, our grandchildren, you know, all the things to encourage them in what they're doing. And, um, she is hilarious. She cracks me up. She is just so She's funny. I mean, there's no other thing to say. So she is just a funny kid. And so I just counted a blessing every day. And then um, my daughter put the phone up and showed the grandbaby and the, the two month old. And she had the biggest smile on her face and just, you know, she wasn't smiling and she had a big smile. It was so sweet. And yes, I want to think it was because she saw me, but I don't know. But she is absolutely beautiful and brilliant and just doing great. Um, she is so funny. My daughter called and she had to go get the, um, our, our other granddaughter. She was picking her up on Mother's Day out and they have to get out of the car and just walk over, you know, just to the sidewalk, you know, it's just right there, you know, like they're in the lane and they get out because they have to get them out of the, they keep them all in one of those like strollers with multiple children's seats. Anyways, so my, um, my, the other grandbaby started crying as soon as she got out and I was like, it's okay, honey. And I was calling her by name and I was like, it's okay. It's all good. And, you know, I was talking to her and she kind of, she was crying and crying. And then I hummed to her the hymn that um I hummed all of my grand my my both granddaughters and my children when I would put them to sleep and it worked like that. She just stopped. And I asked my daughter when she came back, I said, Was she still crying when you got back? And she goes, No, not at all. And I said, Well I hemmed the old Rick across for her, just like I do when I come, you know, and take care of her. And she goes, Oh, okay. Like it was like no big deal. I was thinking Oh, come on. You know, it's a big deal, but it was a big deal to me. <laughs> and I was just so thankful that I had the opportunity to do it. It was just so, so precious. Uh, just that connection, you know, that you have as a grandparent to your grandkids. And I don't know, you know, I mean, we all think our grandparents or our grandchildren are the smartest there are. And yes, mine are. But anyways, <laughs> how obnoxious. I know. <laughs> So I am going to put my habit tracker down here under the focus. 
Um, so what I do in this, this is my, she's in her apron planner. So I put my chores in the house. This has to do with my household, things I do that have to do with our family, household, etc. And then I just write out what I'm going to work on. So today was errands and putting things away. Um, it will be cooking a dinner. And then my, I picked up two sets of Walmart orders at two different places because our Walmart, we can get certain things, certain kind of kombucha. The other Walmart, we get other things. You know how that works. And so um, I'm in like four cities on Mondays, um, Tuesday, Wednesday, Thursday. I'm always at least, if not more. So I take advantage and I pre-order online and I do curbside. And then tomorrow I'll put my chores here before and probably it will be doing... Um, war room and then um and then here in the afternoon i'll put my chores once i pardon me taking my daughter to school and then here you know same thing we're going to be going to our granddaughters um i prep everything the night before and i have it ready to go wednesday morning because we leave very early in the morning and we're in the car for six hours that day um because our youngest daughter has yet to get her driver's license because there is such a backlog we can't get, she can't get a uh, driver's test time. So it's really kind of difficult. But, so we drive 30 minutes, the opposite direction, 30 minutes back. And then two more hours on top of that. And then we come home two hours and then 30 minutes there and 30 minutes back. So it's a six hour day. Um, so Thursday, I'll be prepping everything for us to go um, on our camping trip this weekend for our anniversary. I'm super excited. I know you guys are probably thinking, why are you excited about a camping trip for your anniversary? because I am. It is something very special to me. So my zone this week and my goal is camper. That's my zone this week. It's getting the camper ready. Still needs to be scrubbed down and everything else. We still have to go get and pay the taxes. We just still have a lot to do. So I'm putting the pink there because I'm going to focus on the camper. And then, um, which means I have to scrub the mattress. I've got, you know, I want to get everything clean. Um, I want the carpet scrubbed. I want, um, I got to make sure I get the towels in, things like that. I have all my sheets and blankets are all in there. I just got to get my um, other, I, I know, shower stuff, <laughs> which I would be fine with little bitty towels and washcloths and whatever to dry off with. I'm really easy. I learned a long time ago when you have a lot of kids and kids that are kind of um, persnickety, you are fine. You can dry off with a washcloth, my friends. And I am not a tiny girl. So anyways, okay, to do's brain dump. I want to put this down here because it's just so pretty. Okay, and there's that. And let's see. I want to use this for Josephine's designs. I've been spending a lot of time getting things re-set up for... Um, um, my, uh, what do you call it? Uh, my, to get Josephine's designs up and running and get the Etsy shop open. I'm super, super excited. So there'll be more about that soon. Um, I work on Wednesday, Sunday, so I've got my two things there. I could have used a work sticker, but I had these. I like using these up and I am going to put down here. We will be packing out. I don't think we're leaving Thursday night, but we could, who knows? And then I don't think we're coming home Sunday. We may come home Monday, but I'm not sure. Um, that's a great thing from working at home. You can work anywhere. So, all right. I'm trying to think, is there anything else? Um, I do want to put this sticker here for things I need to load in the camper. Um, it's not always about things in the camper to get done. Yes, that'll be important, but I also need to load certain things. Like I was just saying, the towels and whatnot. Okay, I've used everything but these two, so you know I'm going to use them. I'm just going to use them. Find a way, make a way, right? Okay, so I'm going to put this here because I did run errands this morning. And then I'm going to put this here because this is our day with our granddaughters. And they are so excited. I told my granddaughter, our oldest granddaughter, I said, oh, I've got a, a present for you for Valentine's. And I gave her some of it last week. Um, for And it's for both the girls. And she was like, Really? And I said, yes. I said, you got to be a good girl. When I get there, you know, help mommy, you know, help your sister, do all the things you're supposed to do. You know how I go through the list. And she was just like, mm, you know, and I don't even know if my daughter heard her, but it was so cute. I was just like, yes, I have something special. And I do. I gave them a wonderful little um, 
uh, Christian video last week, and I'm super excited about it. Um, and then I have, um, you know, just for them to start building their, you know, Christian movies for the kids and stuff like that. So, and then I also have just other fun things, a project for us to do that you can make for mom and daddy. And then, um, you know, all that kind of stuff. And then, um, oh, what else did I get? I got coloring books and activity books and I've got play to, you know, I mean, I am just the bag lady when I show up. And so, and she's gotten funny because she knows some things are in the bag and some things are in the crate that I carry our lunch and everything in. And she is getting smart, my friends. She is really trying to figure out where is it? Where'd you put it this time? You know, it, you can just see her wheels turning. It just cracks me up. She is, she's, she's going to keep them hopping. I'm going to tell you that much. And I'll tell you what I've told my husband. I said, she's going to keep them hopping, but let me tell you something. That youngest one is really going to keep them hopping if they're careful. <laughs> and he was like, do you really think so? And I said, oh yeah, that I'm going to put these on here just as to do checklists. Um, oh yeah, they are definitely going to be kept very busy, um, by both those girls. And, um, you know, cause it's so hard, you know, uh, my daughter was trying to say, but I know the things that, you know, the first baby, you know, by name, you know, the first baby did. And I'm like, yes. And she did everything beautifully, but there are things that I even see because she's the second baby she's also doing. And she was like, really? And I said, yes. I said, she's, you know, there are things that she's, you know, clicked in, clued into. So I'm going to use that one. That's because it's a little bit smaller space and I have an extra one so I can do that. All right. And she was just like, really? And I said, yes, it's all good. I promise. So, um, you know, they each have their gifts and talents. They're both going to be lovely you know they are lovely girls and i'm excited to see what god does um it's going to be an amazing amazing time for all of us so i've got these two left and i'm finished with this so you know i'm gonna find a way make a way on this right okay so tomorrow night we are eating out so i'm gonna put that there okay and probably we're gonna pick up something one of the nights that we're out and probably it'll be here on sunday so tomorrow night we have a fantastic barbecue here in our town it's kind of known as the capital of barbecue. Like literally we've had um, Rachel Ray. We've had all kinds of people here because it's very good barbecue in our town. And so I am going to pick up some. Uh, so I'm going to put this here. These are brain dumps. So I will set up like three different areas of things I need to get done. So um, yeah, in the house, I've got three different areas I'm trying to like continually make efforts and get it done. Okay, that's it. So that's where I brain dump that, put that, my zone. This week is camper. Um, my morning routines, my evening routines, I'll just carry that over. I will do my menu planning here and not to bore you guys, but then I will put it on here, hang this in the kitchen. And if I need to make a grocery list, I'm going to tear this off and I will keep that with me. Um, I don't go in the grocery store anymore, but I can use it when I'm going to um, set up my online order. So, because I do curbside. Um, now, I have just sent my husband in the grocery store. So, <laughs> and he wants to every now and then he likes to go in. So, all right, friends, that's it. I hope you guys enjoyed this. If you did, please give it a thumbs up. You can take whatever stickers you have and fit them to whatever size planner you have. And however it's laid out, you just have to find what works for you. I love a little bit of color and design and even the glimmer on a page. It just makes my day. But if that's not your thing, find what works for you. And that's totally perfect. Okay, friends. Um, I pray your day is blessed, creative, and lovely. And um, again, this was the Winter Evergreen Kit by DEKdesigns.com. All that info is listed before. Discount code freebie, sticker sheet, the whole thing. Um, so help yourself. And as, like I said, as the new things come out, they're only going to hang around for about two weeks now. She's going to start rotating the sticker design. So um, if you see something you like, be sure you order it. Okay. It may not be there long. Okay, friends, um, have a great day. Go out and make it a beautiful week. And even though I'm filming this on Valentine's and I know you won't see it till at least Tuesday, 
Um, I just hope you guys have a great day. Probably this will be Wednesday. Wednesday. Okay. I hope you guys have had a great Valentine's. I love you guys. You've been prayed for. And uh, remember, every comment you leave, I write your name on my prayer list and I get to pray for you. And that's my blessing. I love doing that. Okay, friends, have a great day. Love y'all. Be safe. Take care. Bye, y'all.